Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. We are tonight's entertainment. After a while, I, I um, spotted the changes. I became hooked. I had to start making up rules to um, just try and keep it under control. Um, never follow people for too long. Don't follow women down dark alleys after dark. You know, stuff like that. It was supposed to just be completely random. So where are you? You're in some motel room? You just you just wake up and you're in, in a motel room. The part we call the prestige. And did Robert Angier, the great Danton, your employer, get to that final part of his trick that night? Uh, no, sir. Something went wrong. Today is my birthday. And it's a special one because you told me you once told me that when you came back we might be the same age. And today I'm the age you were when you left. <laughs> this might be a real good time for you to come back. You say we talked before? I don't remember that. Yeah, but it's not amnesia. I remember everything up until my injury. I just can't make new memories. So I can't remember talking to you. What did we talk about? Well, dreams, they feel real while we're in them, right? It's only when we wake up that we realize something was actually strange. The dream has become the reality. Who are you to say otherwise? It's not who I am underneath, but what I do that defines me. Bruce? There's nothing easy about two men sharing one life. changes you. I have to think for the first time in a long time, 
why they wanted all this stuff, what it's for. You take it away, you show them what they had. You really want to get this guy, don't you? He killed my wife. He took away my memory. He destroyed my ability to live. Some men aren't looking for anything logical, like money. They can't be bought, bullied, reasoned, or negotiated with. Some men just want to watch the world burn.